If you're looking for a cookie to make this Easter that's really quick and really delicious and mind you like an amazing Easter gift that's edible to give away, check out these Easter cookies. They're covered in coconut. I'm going to show you how to color the coconut and they've got little eggs on top. Um, these are like the easiest thing to make. They have a couple ingredients you probably already have in your fridge right now and they're so delicious but you have to wait till the end of the episode to watch me dig into one of these. We're going to begin by colouring our coconut. So add some coconut into a Ziploc bag. All up you're going to need one cup. We're going to be adding a third into one Ziploc bag with some pink food gel. Give it a good mix. Then in a second bag we're going to be colouring it with some yellow food gel. The third, we're just going to leave plain white. Pop them into a large mixing bowl, use a whisk to mix them up, set them aside and let's move on to the cookie batter. Add some all-purpose flour, baking powder and salt. Sift it and then use a whisk to mix it. In a separate bowl, add some softened butter, cream cheese and some sugar and mix this on high speed until it's nice and creamy. I forgot to add the vanilla extract in there, so I'm gonna add that in there, give it another mix, and we're gonna add our dry ingredients in there, switch over to a spatula, give that a mix until it forms kind of like a paste consistency. It's not quite a cookie dough consistency, I would say. I'm using a cookie scoop which holds about two to three tablespoons of batter to roll these up so they're going to be nice even sizes. It's about the size of a little bit smaller than a golf ball. Roll it around in that colored coconut, place it on some baking trays. This doesn't need to chill in the fridge. Once you've got them all rolled and coated, we're going to be using some mini speckled eggs. Add one in the center of each of your cookies. Pop these in the oven to bake for 20 minutes. Now I made some larger ones here, which is why these cookies look much larger. They do actually spread out a little bit, but these are about one and a half times the size of the ones you saw me make just now. Add two more Easter eggs in the center of your baked cookies. Let these cool down and dig in. So there you have it. These easy Easter coconut cookies are so cute. I cannot get over how cute they are. It's time to dig in. Mm. I don't know if you can see inside that. They're like really soft and they're not like a crispy cookie. They're not a chewy cookie. They're kind of melting your mouth. These are so yum. The recipe is on my website, thescramline.com. Grab it, make it with the kids. It's literally the easiest, cutest cookie to make for Easter. So thank you so much for joining me on the Scram Line. Before I go and dig into literally all of these cookies, here's a preview of my latest savory recipe over on my other channel, thescramline.com. And guys, I'm on TikTok now. Follow me on TikTok. Loads of great videos. I upload them every day and a little bit of behind the scenes stuff as well. By the way, if you're enjoying watching me in my kitchen rather than just voiceovers, let me know because I might do more of this stuff. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you all on the next episode of The Scram Line. Mm. Mm.